everybody. It's Lynette with the Skin Candy. Thank you for joining me again today on another one of our Soapy Time Adventures. This is a remake. Um, this is our oat mill milk and honey. I have my goat's milk powder, colloidal oats, and honey powder already in here. Um, I've been letting it sit for quite a while so it gets uh, nice and um, mixed into the oils. I have my regular batch of oils here. Um, and then what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be splitting it off into three colors. I'm not going to color the base. I'm going to leave it just the natural creamy white that it turns. Uh, naturally, I'm not going to be using any titanium dioxide. So the two colors I'm going to be using today are Sister Golden Hair Surprise. And that is bad, by Mad Micah's. The thing with this is I believe this one's been discontinued. So I will leave the link if they have another one that's goes with I think Goldfinger or the matte gold and then I'm going to be using poppycock I thought those two together might kind of like a real cool honey looking color and then the fragrance I'm going to be using is oatmeal milk and honey from nature's garden I have used this a gazillion times I love it I love the scent retention it doesn't accelerate it doesn't rice and I love how it works in my soap so what we're going to be doing is I'm just going to be uh, mixing this all together I'll be pouring these off Mixing them up. Oh, I forgot to mix them with a little bit of oil. You know what? We'll be okay. I think we'll be okay because I have enough time to work with it. And then we're going to be putting some... Oh, I need to get those. So I'll get those in a minute. But I'm, um, we're going to be putting the bubble wrap on the top to give it kind of the honeycomb look. I don't put oats. Um, one thing that you've probably seen with me is I do not use botanicals on my soaps or my bath bombs or in anything. I use infusions of them. I'll use, um, I'll make my own oat milk or I'll make my own rice water. Um, I'll do my own lavender infused oils and infuse them in oils. In fact, I have comfrey and calendula and chamomile and lavender and rose that are all infusing right now in, in olive oil um, upstairs in my window. But I do not use botanicals on the tops of my soaps. I think they look horrible. They go brown, they fall off. I don't like them in my shower. Um, oatmeal goes slimy. So I don't know, tell me in the comments below if you guys like botanicals. And if that's something you guys would like to see, I'll be more than happy to do some soaps with some botanicals. But I have never made a soap. I've made two soaps that I put botanicals on. One was lavender and one was rose and I hated both of them. So I would rather just do infusions and you get all the goodness infused into the oil than watching the petals go down your drain or having to scoop it out after you're done taking a bath. Ugh. That just, sorry, that's just me. I'm kind of weird that way. So I think we have everything ready to go. We are doing our triple batch today. So hopefully I can get it measured out. It's a little bit trickier trying to get these measured out this time to get them into the, the height that I want. So, and I want them all to be as even as possible. So I think we'll get going. So without further ado, let's get soaping.